New tonight, a Chattanooga man is shot and killed outside of a convenience store. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Allie Levine. It happened here on West 38th Street just before 7 o'clock. Chattanooga police say the man died on the scene. Our crew was there as police began their investigation. Family and friends of the victim waited for information outside of crime scene tape. The victim's mother confirming to News Channel 9 her son's identity. Jacoby Jordan's mother told James Torres her son was young, hardworking, and not another statistic. Tonight, Chattanooga police now looking at all potential leads. All of the investigation is early on. We are currently looking at all leads. We ask anyone that they know any information, saw this incident, please call us the homicide tip line. That investigation closed two parts of East 38th, one on Central Avenue and the other on Doris Street. The people you see gathered here at the scene of the shooting were already together when they got the call. That's because earlier today they were celebrating the life of another man killed by gunfire almost two years ago. James Torres saw family and friends go from celebration to grief in just a matter of hours. James. Yeah, Allison, in this picture here, you see a mother surrounded by family and friends as they stand over the grave of Orlandis Gay. This was at Forest Hill Cemetery. Gay was shot and killed in May of 2016, and since then his mother would come to his grave near the anniversary and release balloons. Gay's mother, Louise Spell, says she went through depression and considered suicide when her son died. She says leading up to this day, she was just getting back on her feet. God gave him to me. I had to give him back to God. You know, I see him ups and down, but you know, I go and read the Bible and, and talk to my friends. Bell tells me that today's victim is her nephew. She says that the family received that phone call of the tragic news right after they left the cemetery. Allie. James, thanks. Today's shooting marks the sixth homicide of the year. Chattanooga police say the investigation is ongoing. If you have any information, you're asked to call CPD's homicide line. That